my name is uh, Spenta Vadia. I, I am the founding director of this institute. And uh, since I happen to be living temporarily on campus, <laughs> I have been asked to uh, you know, speak a little bit about the ICTS and uh, what it is, what we do. So uh, that's why I'm here, because it's a Sunday afternoon, and uh, I think uh, <laughs> the present director, Rajesh Govkumar, lives a little distance away, and uh, I think it's fine. I do know something about the ICTS still. Okay, so uh, <clears throat> you must have gone around the campus and uh, seen our facilities already, uh, but uh, you must be wondering what we do here. See, this is a facility of the Tata Institute of Fundamental Research. It's a government of India facility, and you must be wondering what we do here. So our main task, the main goal of the ICTS is uh, to bring people together, people in physics, astronomy, cosmology, mathematics, biology, from all over the world, including India, of course, and the neighborhoods, uh, to be under one roof. And uh, this coming together, I mean, has a, has a few uh, goals in mind. And, uh, you know, we are basically interested in solving some of the most challenging questions posed by nature. This is the final goal to be able to solve important problems of science. And of course also, uh, important problems of science are solved by scientists who have to be trained. So we are also participant, like here you are today, uh, to provide advanced science education. And also to create a scientific temper in our society. About the, what, is, what is the meaning of the pursuit of truth? So that is the issue of scientific temper, and the ICTS prof, uh, provides uh, ample opportunities and a platform to discuss these matters also. Okay, so this is what we do, and uh, how is it enabled, what are our engines? So we have uh, three missions, broadly speaking. There are programs, in-house research, and uh, based on the resources of programs and in-house research, we are actively involved in scientific outreach also. And uh, this is a sample of some of our programs, this is just the posters. You can visit our website where you can find all these details. Now, what are programs? They consist of uh, various parts. I mean, we can have Pedagogical schools, that's one of the programs. Workshops and conferences, and discussion meetings. And since 2007, when the ICTS started functioning, it started functioning in TIFR Mumbai, then it moved to the Indian Institute of Science, whilst this campus was being built. And uh, we are here since uh, 2015, but our work started in 2007, and since then we have organized about uh, 133 programs, 58 discussion meetings, and we have had over 5,000 participants, uh, many of them from abroad, 20% from abroad. And this has made a tangible impact on the Indian science scene at various levels in research, education, etc. Now, programs are a new model for scientific exchange and collaboration in India. So ICTS is a unique institution in India. There is no such institution in India that does this type of, which has this type of mission, these three missions I told you. It, it uh, proposes or does place researchers together to sort of brainstorm, to incubate new ideas, and to chart out roadmaps. And this can only be done if you congregate and spend time together in a nice setting over here. We also have a strong pedagogical component uh, in our programs which benefits students and postdocs and even senior researchers. After all, in science, we are students all our lives. So uh, I cannot say that I know everything. Therefore, 
I myself actually, I think I'm the oldest, oldest person uh, who is on the faculty of the ICTS, find myself learning things all the time. And it's an amazing opportunity to do that. And all our talks and programs are archived on YouTube and uh, the channel is ICTS Talks. And there is no gap between ICTS and talks because that's something else, okay? All right, so here are sample programs. Uh, the reason to flash this is to tell you that our, we are an institution without prejudice. We don't only do string theory, we also work in areas of mathematics, cosmology, <clears throat> climate science, and biology. And these are also the programs that we have are just uh, so far spread across the landscape of scientific inquiry. And though in, even though it's a theory center, I mean, uh, many of these programs have a lot of experimentalists uh, over here. So in some sense at ICTS, uh, theory and experiment sort of come face to face. We also have uh, other activities, you know, which are geared for more advanced uh, education. So we have the Infosys ICTS lecture series. So Infosys name is there because they have kindly supported these uh, named lecture series, which have been going on for a long time, but now we have their support. And uh, there are three series, one in, in honor of Subramaniam Chandrasekhar, another in honor of uh, Srinivasa Ramanujan, uh, and the other one in honor of Alan Turing. And they cover very broad, almost all of science, Chandrasekhar covers the physical sciences, and you can see how distinguished all these people are. Next week, we are going to have Juan Maldasena over here. I mean, uh, perhaps one of the most significant theoretical physicists in the area of string theory and uh, gravitation after Stephen Hawking. Juan Maldasena will be here next week. And Michael Berry is giving a brilliant talk, actually. Uh, a brilliant set of lectures, John Shaker lectures. I heard him very recently, so I say so. Uh, also, then Ramanujam lectures are for pure mathematics, and the Turing is for biology, computer science, engineering, and related areas. And ICTS is starting a new series of lectures uh, in honor of D.D. Kosambi. Uh, and the first uh, inaugural lecture will be on 24th of May here. Uh, and will be delivered by Pratap Bhanu Mehta, who is the Vice Chancellor of Ashoka University, a well-known uh, scholar, philosopher, historian, and a columnist. So uh, these are also our activities. ICTS provides a platform for new initiatives in Indian science. It means people come here, want to discuss what new things we should do, and uh, here are a few examples. Nodal Center for LIGO India, then pilot phase of India Light, large data, high-speed networks. And we have a quantitative biology program, which uh, uh, sort of uh, uh, toggles between ICTP in Trieste and uh, ICTS, uh, the Cowley Winter Schools, uh, Mathematics of Planet Earth, and summer courses, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So it, it, it's a, it's a platform for new initiatives. For example. You are here. I think this is a new initiative. You know. It's a new initiative for so many people to be looking at astronomical data and mm -hmm. leading some science out of it. So we have provided this platform, and I think it's a wonderful thing. Then Sri G Srinivasan's lectures are there. Again, this year, we are having uh, lectures starting in May and June. Now we come to the second most important platform of the mission of the ICTS, and that is uh, we want to be outstanding in research. So ICTS has some of the most outstanding scientists actually working here as its faculty. So presently we have, uh, this is the number, and we'll go up to 3035 eventually in the next decade. And uh, the, the areas we focus on in research can be divided into three parts, complex systems, space-time physics, and mathematics. And uh, here they are. And this is what they do. So the research areas are data assimilation and dynamical systems theory. Statistical physics, condensed matter physics, fluids, physical biology. So this is all part of uh, complex systems. 
Then there is interdisciplinary mathematics, geometry, probability theory, partial differential equations, and then there is space-time physics. Astrophysical relativity, the group that works on gravitational wave astronomy, and uh, then there is string theory and quantum gravity. And this has to be there because the, this institute was begun by string theorists. So, and string theory is a very overarching subject in theoretical sciences because uh, it, in a sense, has some overlap with almost everything that is there written above it. You might find it a bit uh, strange, but that's actually true. That it's a new framework for looking at theoretical physics. So we have a very vibrant postdoctoral and graduate students program. And uh, these are the numbers, a large number of students, over 40 and uh, postdoctoral fellows, visiting students, and we have other summer program students also. Then we come to the third mission, the outreach. Here are a few pictures of outreach. There are some very distinguished people uh, <clears throat> trying to stimulate and harness young minds of India. And uh, science outreach is in terms of public lectures. Okay, so when eminent scientists come for our programs, we also ask them to give public lectures. So next week, next Friday, is the public lecture by Juan Maldacena, actually, who will be visiting here next week. We also have uh, Einstein lectures, up to Salam lectures, uh, covering uh, different aspects of uh, knowledge and scientific inquiry. So here are some very distinguished people over here. Uh, you have Manjul Bhargava and uh, Jennifer Chase, uh, Edward Witten, uh, Natty Zyberg, Andy Strominger, Peter Sarnak, and, uh, and uh, I forget this famous biologist, Sidney Brenner. Sidney Brenner. There's some more photos. And uh, we had an exhibition actually in uh, um, 2013 uh, at the planetarium uh, about mathematics, the ubiquitousness of mathematics in the real world. And we also plan to have a science festival actually sometime in January, uh, which you will hear about uh, uh, shortly, organized by ICTS and NCBS and Trishti and many other institutions in this city. Okay, the last slide is about copy and curiosity. This is the <clears throat> this is the, uh, this is the um, the outreach which is uh, extremely popular, and uh, you must have uh, been to one of these outreach uh, uh, programs in the planetarium. Every month it is there, and next uh, one is on 27th May. Joseph Samuel is delivering a talk on black holes and steam engines. I'm myself very curious really what he's going to talk about. <laughs> so uh, this is about copy and curiosity. So that uh, more or less covers uh, the landscape of what the ICTS is and what it does. Thank you.